Hey everybody, the Bond is back. Welcome to part 43 of Let's Play The Binding of Isaac Afterbirth, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Okay, if you watched that last run, I really hope you didn't, because that was just a train wreck in itself. So I think we're going to avoid the loss for at least a few videos at a time. We'll come back to him eventually, but for now, let's just do Eve Hush Mega Satan. Alright, so our seed is HJQ6. 3C... JW. Alright, let's do this. Undefined right away. You know what? If we're gonna be strong, we might as well just use the razor blade right now. And then start using undefined every chance we could, and well, it's a good thing that I already grabbed the item room. But we're gonna miss out on a boss item. So we got an, an error room on the first use of undefined. That is just beyond crazy. You know... We can still lose this run, like, immediately. That's how weird it is. And you know what? I don't even know why I'm fighting these guys. Okay, well, that just gave me a bit of a time buffer. But to have, like, your air room item be holy water, uh, that's a bit of a slap in the face. At least Undefined will give us, like, a little bit of an easy out for certain things, like grabbing a free boss rush item. So I guess I can't feel too bad. Black Feather, I think I get a damage up just for having Horror Babylon. Remember, you get more damage based on the evil items you have. I don't think your damage goes down by having good items, like, say, Holy Water. If so, that'd be another reason I hate Holy Water, let me tell ya. <laughs> it's already a pretty shitty item that could just be made shittier by that very restriction to the power of Black Feather. I would have liked to try to get those jars, but I'm not going to waste too much time on them. It feels good to play as a character that has health. Because that last run, like, playing as the Lost was probably not my greatest idea. Let's put it that way right now. Let's kind of open our secret rumors right there. It is not. So we need some keys. If we can get some health, that would be amazing too. And you know, I won't feel so bad if we do take HP. You know what, we'll take it, based on the principle that we should get something from Black Feather. There's still a chance to get a key. So I'm not going to feel too mad about having my damage downgraded. It was either that or just bring myself closer to death. And I was not willing to do that yet. Would I have been better off with a razor blade? Possibly. But there's no way of knowing for sure. Okay, we get some pills. Are you a wizard? Not happy about that. Range down, definitely not happy about that. Paralysis. Wow. Those pills have sucked. Alright, so we're pretty much to the grindstone again. Only we have a lot more to work with, as opposed to what we had before, which was nothing. Let me see if we can get to our top secret room. I doubt I'm going to get two arrow rooms in a row. Okay, we got the D4. Fuck it, I'm doing it. Okay, we got Rotten Baby number two, Shield of Tears, and Charm of the Vampire. You know what? This might actually be... Yeah. I was gonna say it was awesome until you realize that can happen. So, we pretty much lost our deal with the devil right there. Because of that dumb BS, but oh well. It comes with the territory. I guess when it comes to, like, the angel statues... Oh god. You probably don't have to worry so much, because then... You just stay right next to the angel statue until you number two bomb it. That could be like one practical advantage of this item. Even though it has a more likelihood of killing you. And having no soul hearts definitely does not help favors at all. Yeah, we missed out on that deal with the devil because of that bullshit, but oh well. Huh, we got another error room that also have two ragmen. 
Well, at least rubber cement is a good enough item to take, as opposed to what holy water was. I still want to stick with Undefined because it has a greater potential to help me out as opposed to the D4, which could actually, you know, make things worse. Is it just me, or am I, like, uh, shooting out these bombs very fast compared to, like, other runs? Okay, well, there was nothing I could have done there. Like, come on. Like, what do you want me to do? I was literally getting no soul hearts whatsoever to ensure that I get Angel President. Like, not one. That's ridiculous. Not to mention, this damage is still pretty low. Charm of the Vampire is sadly not an evil item. Y you'd think it would! I mean, vampires have been known to be pretty bad. And I'm talking about, like, Twilight Vampires. They're, they're pretty bad. Even they didn't like their work. <laughs> Like, if you can, like, know anything about the cast of Twilight, is that they hated Twilight. And they never realized how popular it would be. You know, by teen girl standards. But still, that's just downright absurd. I really should watch myself while I'm just waiting to, like, get at these mushrooms. I'm not warping, because I know I'm just going to get another error room. Uh, my, the inner eye? Well, triple shot might help. I mean, sometimes it's looked down on. For obvious reasons. But we'll try to make it work. I suppose we'll grab the bomb bag. And I think that's all we're gonna do. So we're gonna get to our boss. We're probably gonna miss out on yet another devil deal. Surprise, surprise. But if we can just get Hush, I mean... I'll be satisfied. I would have much preferred to get both. But if I can't get both, at least get the one that you don't have to cripple yourself with your abilities so much. Alright, okay, there's our boss. Good. Ah, Polycephalus is good because you can actually hit him with three of them. By them, I mean my shots. Still gonna be a lengthy fight based on this damage, but at least I got something with my butt bombs. And the occasional help from Rotten Baby. And whatever shots are coming my way, I can block them. Too bad that butt bomb didn't work. There. Still no deal with the devil that I would have liked to reject anyway. So I guess it's just down to the next floor. Wow, we're not doing really well. In fact, we haven't picked up a single soul heart this entire run. Four floors down. You know, the uh, tribute band for three doors down. We haven't got a single soul heart or a single black heart. We got an extra HP. I mean, that's fine. But it still doesn't help us with our angel slash devil precedent. At least we're getting bomb bag to help out. If that's saying much. Wow, our damage just outright sucks, even with Jesus Juice. Like, it could stand to be so much better. Oop! Back away! Maybe I should just kill the bonies first, before I just create all of them. Oh god, they're closing in on me. They should have not has, has got... Bleh! They should not have gotten as close as they have. Don't know why that was such a struggle for me to even say. It's probably just too much on my mind. Like, I'm just recording... Oh, God. I'm recording this episode just shortly after finishing the last one. Which has been an absolute clusterfuck in itself that should never have come to fruition. But because I had some items unlocked to go towards my collection to get to that 1,001% achievement... I pretty much had to leave that run in. And just the fact that I've been struggling after so many wins in a row, maybe it was better just keep that in. Tech 2? Well, it can't be any worse than what I already have. Oh my god, no, that's just regular technology. Um, 
This is downright weird. It looks like a freaking light show. I can't even tell if I'm hitting them or not. Like, if you got bad fit, if you're full of photosensitive, I feel bad for you guys, or you're epileptic, because this is just downright absurd. Oh god. Okay, that was bullshit. It was either get hit by my own bombs or hit by theirs. Like, I was pretty much in a no-win situation still. So I don't know how they can manage to keep this up on me. <sighs> it never ends. Oh, thanks for all those uh, hearts. Yeah, I have no point in trying to get them all now. It's a bit too late for that. This run is really trying hard to fuck me. Please help. Well, technology with rubber cement has the potential to be amazing. But I think the triple shot just makes it bizarre. I mean, just look at it. It looks like I'm just creating some kind of V, and it's not coming out right. So you just, like, go all over the place. Like, what do? <sighs> oh, God. You're gonna give me the stain after all that, huh? After all I've endured, you're gonna give me the freaking stain. One of the worst bosses in the game. Oh yeah, and now, now I can't see him. You know what's gonna happen. Brace yourselves. Oh, okay, never mind. Oh, wow, that was just the worst kind of damage I could have taken right there. Someone toss out my lasers! Blech. Can't even, like, destroy the shots. Okay, I, I can get used to dodging the stain now. It doesn't make it any better. In fact, we're gonna miss out on devil deals for like three straight floors now. Let's be realistic, that's gonna happen. See, I missed out on yet another devil deal. Oh, thanks for the black heart. Like one floor too, like several floors too late. Oh, the D4 I think actually screwed me. Lucky Toe. Well, I'm not going to take any evil items, so I might as well go with that. How did I avoid damage there? That's beyond me. Oh, there's a little mysteries, everyone. <laughs> also, I find it very sad. I never got a soul heart from that. But, oh well, life goes on. At least I have something... That can allow me to reject the devil deal. That will make me happy. Or maybe I should just like, fuck, make a Satan and just go sh take whatever devil deal I can. I don't even know why I'm bothering to go back. I, I should at least try to get to the boss as fast as possible. You know, before I screw myself. That's judgment. Okay. Yeah, well, we'll just take on the boss right now. That'd be a more logical choice, if we're being honest with ourselves. Also, I should be blowing up more of these. Okay, it's low-key. I don't mind low-key. I do mind that spike there, though. Kind of wish it wasn't there. And, you know, clearing out those rocks kind of helps make this arena a little bit more open. Eh! Almost got me. This guy's almost dead. There we go. We finally got ourselves a devil deal that we're not going to take anyway. Pretty fly. Okay. Range down. Don't want. Pheromones. Okay. Paralysis. We should still try for Mega Satan. So I'm actually going to pass this up. You might think this is crazy because I'm going to be leaving behind Black Feather and I could be getting some nice damage by way of the pact. But, I'm a stubborn guy. And I'd rather, like, try for two and see myself get neither than just, like, play it safe only getting one. 
even though sometimes my gameplay might dictate otherwise, I still feel that I should try, you know, go for the ultimate Hail Mary. Because sometimes that gets you on Sports Center. Let me tell you that much right now. Like, we want to play like we want to be on Sports Center. You know, with RE, that's on TSN, as opposed to uh, ER, which is ESPN. Well, I guess you're, you can find like a lot of stuff about the ER on ESPN when they're talking about football and concussions and stuff. They barely talk about hockey, but oh well. You know, they don't have to. I mean, hockey is... Well, I guess hockey is kind of becoming their sport now in the U.S. Because, I mean, the Americans do pretty well in some international play. What the hell am I talking about? You guys don't care about that shit. Maybe some of you actually do, and that's fine. But, oh well. A lot of people don't usually watch Isaac videos just to talk about hockey. Or ESPN. Oh, well, thank you, uh, Troll Bomb, for being so benevolent to save me a bomb. Too bad I couldn't use rubber cement to work in my favor. Oh! <laughs> okay. Oh, Jesus. Okay, so I can just reroll my run again. Can't be any worse than what I had. Oh, God. I got Eden's Blessing, so the next run's gonna have something absurd. Oh, I got Serpent's Kiss! I like this! Okay, we'll take Aquarius. Got Halo Flies, Peeper's Eye, Harlequin Baby, The Relic, Cricket's Body. Oh, God, I got Eve's Mascara. And I got scatter bombs. Okay, I just noticed that. Okay, now I got the ability to fly, so a lot of problems have been resolved. Not all of them, but we still have to try to get like two key pieces within just a few more floors. And time's running out. Look, I've been wanting to defend a tech tech x for like a long time because the last time we had it we didn't exactly have a good run we can probably have a good run now with this item because you know <laughs> we weren't playing as lazarus that was pretty much what fucked us okay a gold key that's nice to know i got that before i uh, got through any of those gold chests okay now we just gotta hope for that occasional chance of uh Serpent's Kiss paying out with some black hearts. I don't think it's gonna pay out as much because remember I relied on like physical contact in order to get those black hearts. Or maybe it's just dependent on luck, I don't know. There's only one way to find out now, is there? Oh, thank you for that soul heart, by the way. At least we don't have to worry about number two possibly ruining our run anymore. Well, that could still do so if you keep getting hit by that so many times. Okay, we gotta find our item room or shop. Preferably both right next to each other. Okay, this could be big for us. Oh, that's good enough. I'm gonna get rid of all these troll fires first. Man, Tech X really wrecks these guys. Wreck X, I'm telling ya. Thank you, Relic. Thank you. Oh, that was my fault. I think two of hearts. Yeah, whatever. I'm better off with judgment. Why am I sticking around here? Oh, that's right. It's another card. Two of spades. Sure. We'll use that right away. I'll stick with a judgment card. Thank you very much. Because so I can get some practical use out of it. Amnesia? Well, we're pretty much at the end of this floor anyway. And this card is two of spades again. Okay, whatever. We're not gonna get like a ten cents to like increase our angel chances, unfortunately. But maybe just two cents will increase it by a small percent. Or it probably won't. Maybe we had to put in exactly ten cents minimum to increase our angel chances 
But sometimes you can get fucked by that, because let, let's face it, the donation machines don't always take that much. So whenever we get money, we'll, we'll just dump it in here. Because we don't really need it anymore. Judgment. Okay, it was just a regular judgment. Well, I kind of don't want to blow that up. It was a demon judgment? That, can, that could increase your angel chances, believe it or not. If you blow up a demon judgment or a key beggar. Don't understand how key beggars fall in that category. I mean, they're beggars too. But apparently they don't count as good beggars. It seems a bit discriminatory. But whatever. So the race is on to get some key pieces. That means we have to get like deals with the angel and like three out of four floors. No, and two out of three floors. And we're probably not going to be able to do it. What is in our boss rush anyway? None of these are good enough to take. In a way that makes me feel happy because then I won't be tempted. Okay. We have to get like deals with the angel in two straight floors. That's a very tall order. Even if you factor the Joker card or Red Chest that warp you. That's right, I don't have Undefined anymore. I gave that up because of the sixth room. Okay. Well, we're way ahead of schedule for Hush. That's a positive. Not exactly the perfect positive, but it's a positive nonetheless. In what could be a very shitty run. Oh, yeah, I forgot I also have Dry Baby and uh, Little Gish. I couldn't even see them on my uh, screen on the right. Probably because I had so many items. Uh, I could get something out of this. Oh, oh, get, get away. Yep, yeah, Tammy's head's good enough. It's an actual spacebar item. Okay, I was kind of hoping it would just create more of those lasers. That would have been hilarious. But I'm okay with this. At least now we have a plan B if Tech X is not exactly working out for us in the current battle. Man, I wish I had that Serpent's Kiss run where I was just amassing black hearts like crazy. I don't seem to be doing that. It's just not happening as well as I'd like. But this run is still good. It just could stand to be better. Oh, you're toast, Dingle. Yeah. Okay, are we even going the right way? Like, are we there yet, Ma? I don't know. Ask your father. Are we there yet? Ask your mother. <laughs> it's just like the endless cycle. I'm telling ya. Maybe they just don't know. Have yeah, you ever thought about that? You only think about yourselves. You want to get to, like, a... I don't know. You want to get to Jungle Gyms all the time. Which is a popular Canadian establishment, by the way. Mostly in Atlantic Canada. I don't know if you guys even heard about it. But man, every time they have the enchiladas, that's, I go buckwalled for that. Because they are pretty much the most awesome thing in the world. Do we take the left hand? I think we should take the left hand because we could get warped into a devil or angel room. We might lose out on the chance for dad's key. But... We still gotta try for other options. Hematemesis, whatever. Bad gas is also whatever. Amnesia sucks, paralysis also sucks. Look, let, let's just try to see if we can earn an angel deal normally. And if we don't, then well, we can try to get a key piece by way of the self-sacrifice room. So it's good to know there's a self-sacrifice room even there. And I was getting kind of worried we would not get one. We did not get one. That 
blows my mind. So I guess we're gonna have to try to get our key pieces this way. That sucks. Lemon party. Ugh, two paralysis pills. Well, that sucks. You know, those chests could still warp us. Eh, that's a free play right there. Why is that even a thing? There, we got ourselves an angel battle. And you all thought I was crazy. In fact, some of you probably still think I am. Because now we just brought ourselves closer to death. Okay, that's one key piece. Alright, now we have to go scrambling. Look for all the soul hearts and uh, red hearts that I could have picked up but didn't because I was full. Speaking of which, it's one right there. So let's go grab another one. So now I don't feel so bad. I was kind of lost in where I was going, by the way, but... <laughs> That's pretty much, like, the brakes. Okay, grab all this shit. I'll just blow some of this stuff up for no reason. There might be a rogue tinted rock or something that I don't know is even there. Blow this shit up, too. There we go. Oh, oh, I'm, I'm missing something over here. It's right at this point. Okay, so we got a lot of our health back. So now, we just need to go over and uh, get the other, uh, get back to the self-sacrifice room and hope to God that we don't have to play it so many times in order to get the other key piece. Is it like five more times? No. Whoa! Okay. Okay, self-sacrifice rooms have been the MVP. Holy shit! Everything is coming to fruition! That This could actually be an amazing run! We can also, like, play it more times just to get warped straight to, I don't know, the Dark Room or something. You know, just go straight to the Mega Satan battle without doing anything else. So, you know what? We don't need the left hand anymore. I should go back for a Lucky Toe. Oh man, we may not even make it to Hush if I keep slowing down like this. No, no, don't take that. We're good with Tammy's head. So that was a weird play! That we actually made the self-sacrifice rooms work exactly the way we wanted them to! Not only that, we brought ourselves nearly to full health! So we were in a much better position or, actually, we were pretty much in the exact position we started in when we tried those self-sacrifice rooms in the first place. Only now we're even better. That is crazy! To make up for all the bullshit that I endured on the last run, we're having a run that's actually very positive. Out of a very... unexpected way to pull that off. So we're probably gonna get Eve's post-it note completely filled at this rate. Provided, you know, Hush doesn't kill us, or Mega Satan doesn't kill us. Those things are still possible. We don't want them to be possible, so that's why we're gonna do our damnedest. And that is not the way to do it, by the way. Thank you, Diglett. I was wondering where you were too. Okay, that was not the room I went to before? Oh. Okay. Fantastic, I'm just wasting time now. Two of clubs, doesn't really matter. That doesn't matter either. In fact, that's not worth taking. Wait, oh, that was Bob's brain. Oh. No, one of those was Bob's rotten head, and the other one was Bob's brain. Oh, Bob is really trying to make his name known. Yes, I know, Bob. Reboot is coming out soon. Well, at least the rebooted version of Reboot. It's gonna be different from, like, how I remembered Reboot, and that, that terrifies me. Because that's not how I remember Reboot. I'll give it a shot if I get a chance to watch it, but... 
Man, that shit was the jam growing up. That and like Shadow Raiders, Beasties, also normally known as Beast Wars because apparently it uh, changed the name for like outside of North America or something. Well, apparently Canada was called Beasties, but you know what I mean. On YTV, that was like the jam growing up. That along with Rocco's Martin Life, Angry Beavers, they were pretty much my favorite shows. That and Hey Arnold. They don't make shit like that anymore. Not saying they should like just go back to their roots, like like the hell with the new shows. I mean, kids will enjoy them just as much as we enjoy the old shows. So we get an angel deal anyway. Ah, uh, the rosary. Fine, I'll take it. But it doesn't really help our chances. Oh, right, the room's over there now. I was getting kind of worried, like, where did it go? And it just came up the same side that I just popped out of. Alright. I should stop rambling so much. The Joker? Oh, too late. I already did my business with that self-sacrifice room. The Bible or the poop? Yeah, real funny. Uh, Mr. Mega for sure. Even though a case could be made for Tech Point Five, then again, not really. If I had to get one thing out of my way, I'd, I'd rather take the poop. And that's saying something. At least the poop could give me something. Um, hive mind, sure. And I can't really buy anything else, so we'll just donate the rest. Well, I guess I could buy something else. There we go, we got ourselves a nickel. We'll hold on to those five cents, I might need that soul heart. Um... I'll stick with Lucky Togs, I might get some stuff in the chest if I decide to commit to it. Alright, so, moment of truth. Can we, like, snap our hush losing streak of, like, so many lost lives and a blue baby life? <laughs> Ugh. Let's close that dark chapter in our lives forever. Probably wait a while before he plays the Lost again. Maybe we can unlock it for him and lock Holy Mantle on him and through greed mode. Or we'll try it again at a much sooner time. But for now, let's just deal with what we got now. You know what? Tech X is actually pretty good on uh, against Hush. Because it just hits him for quite a while. And the occasional Serpent's Kiss damage might help. It just takes a while for Tech X to charge to be at its full potential. Wow! Those shots were just staying there. We're not doing a ton of damage, but we're doing damage. In fact, we got into retreat immediately. Let's see, like this. Okay, I think the bombs actually do a little bit more damage. By like a small amount, but still. That's pretty impressive. That's why you take Mr. Mega. It's hard to pass that item up. It still doesn't do much against the flies. Man, imagine running to, against these flies as normal enemies everywhere else. You'd be having a really hard time. Like, don't suggest that for, like, the, the next DLC that's coming out in 2016, Afterbirth Plus, I think it's called. Or it could be, like, Afterbirth Cross. I don't know what Ed McMillan's calling it. But hey, if you keep releasing DLC, I will keep buying it. That might be a dangerous precedent, but this game is worth it. Okay, I think we should be safe here. Am I occasionally slowing him down? It shouldn't seem like that. What item do I have that allows it? I... Okay, I, I just remember I do have Eden's Blessing, that's good. I don't have Spider Bite or Spider Mod. Well, Spider Mod might occasionally petrify them. I don't think that Serpent's Kiss doing that. We should be in a good position to win now. That's right, the scatter bombs are actually putting in some work. Okay, 
we should win this now. I feel so mad if we do this without taking a single hit, because why couldn't I have that a video earlier? That would just make me so rotted. Like, only now I get a run against Hush, where I take no hits. But then again, this run is so much better. We might stand a very good chance of being a, getting a flawless win. And that would just amaze me. Oh my god, we actually did it. And we got the Athami item. That's actually a pretty good item. Uh, that's right, we gotta go up. I remember seeing that item when uh, Tyrone did the PAX reveal of this game. And Athami was one of the items that showed up. Apparently what it does is that whenever you get hit, you create, like, a ring. Similar to what Ma the Void does. Only it's a ring you don't charge. It's a ring that automatically activates whenever you take damage. That could be pretty powerful. So I'm kind of, like, doing some mild spoilers before I even pick up the item myself. Which I probably will at some point because it does look pretty bitchin'. And probably synergize as well. But we'll cross that bridge when we get there. I mean, first, we just gotta, like, get through this run. Oh my god, I didn't even see that douchebag. Okay, that wasn't the right way. Oh, I'll pick that up. Surprise, surprise, Bongo went the wrong direction. I think I already seen this pill. Yeah, it was amnesia. <laughs> well, it's kind of pointless. I already got Curse of the Lost. Seems redundant to, like, get amnesia pills on this floor. Ah, oh, thank you for killing your own ally. I'm sure he greatly appreciates that. Now, we could get Magic Mush and still have a very solid run that could get even better. A range down obviously would not do that for us. Maybe it wouldn't matter. I suppose a range up wouldn't even matter either. Oh, good thing I got through there before the bombs exploded. That would have been some dumb damage. That I had no business taking. Yeah, I'm really loving Tech X. Oh, an Eternal Heart. I probably should not take that. Well, I guess I'm going to take that Soul Heart now that was there. <laughs> ah, check for a crawl space. You know, Hail Mary. Which is a very funny thing to say inside the cathedral. You know, Virgin Mary. I never had a Bloody Mary, come to think about it. Okay, head of the Keeper. I could have had that a bit sooner. Okay, it doesn't change the look of your laser. I, I've had Bloody Mary wings before. You know, like the pin Pinties. I'm sure you've heard about them. They were in Canada. And they have the, the brand of chicken products. Including wings. So they have this thing called Caesar Wings with a celery salt seasoning and, you know, Bloody Mary uh, wing sauce. Which is pretty OP by all kinds of chicken wing hot, you know, wing sauce standards. And to be honest, you know, my sister doesn't like them because she finds the celery salt seasoning way too strong. And, you know, I kind of don't blame her. But that shit's still good. So, uh, fuck her, uh, sensory reactions. <laughs> now, if she was allergic, then, you know, different story. Then I'll, I won't buy them anymore, and if I do, then I'll just wait till you know, we're not living together anymore. But come on. Don't take those, uh, wings away from me. Got the bomb. Okay, Dry Baby's putting in work, even though I don't really expect him to. He's so diligent holding that key for me as well. Like, I like that. I, I like when your familiars actually hold the key for you. It just shows that they see it as important. Like, it's important to me and it's going to be important to them. Like, they are literally an annex of me. Okay? That's how it is. I'm coming for you, Mega Stan. Uh... Tech X Monstro's Long? How does that work? Okay. 
Oh my god. I like this. Okay, yeah. We'll go with that synergy. I don't know how long it takes to charge. But at least you don't have to wait too long. Damage could be better. But it could be a lot worse. It could have just simply not worked. Oh yeah, I can't forget that I can fly. I think this is better as like a shotgun item. Like what I mean is I like, use it from like close range. Rather than like from far away. But if you can charge it for like a long time, by all means be as far away as you want. Other than that, you're, you're just better off just playing things safe. I am aware that you do have to charge it for at least an average amount of time. In order to get something out of it. Oh, Peeper's Eye actually took out that piece of envy for me. Man, this is gonna suck that I can... Like, take no hits against Mega Saiyan and Hush as Eve when I need to do this as the Lost and I can't even get to that point. That just infuriates me. Because you have more potential to have, like, a decent damaging run as the Lost than you do with Eve. That blows my mind. But, I, I'll have to eventually accept it. As much as I don't really want to. I want to live in denial just a little bit longer, but I can't do that much longer. I should just accept the fact that I'm able to do that with anyone. Okay, just remember when a Gabriel folds its wings, it's when it's going to go diagonal. Oh, okay. At least I'm not getting my signals crossed. Well, that was a bit of a weird fluctuation there. Finally, that thing's dead. Uh, you don't stand a chance, Mega Satan. I pretty much got you corner fucked. Or side fucked. That sounds... Sounds like something you would do to a mistress. Like, you know, all three of them at the same time, but... Well, I guess all three of are gonna be at the same time rather than, like, sequential. Oh my god, we actually just wrecked Mega Saiyan so easily! God, this was a pretty interesting episode. We got the Horror Baby and Lil Baby unlocked. Wow. We're, we're doing really well for ourselves. Despite that little setback in the previous episode. So there we go. In the next part, we'll have ourselves another run. Goodbye, everyone. Thanks for watching.